Now today we will be talking about one of the many invasive species of Missouri, feral hogs, and how you can put an end to their madness. I believe we should start with the problems they cause. That is a good idea. Alrighty then. One of the problems with feral hogs is that they are highly destructive and eat nearly anything they can. So what are your thoughts on that? Well, first off, I would suggest to put tall fences around all your crops and livestock to keep the feral hogs away because they can carry diseases and spread them to your livestock. Good idea. Another problem that feral hogs are causing is that they are eating our native wildlife like us middle schoolers eat McDonald's. Chicken nuggets. And if it keeps happening, it can lead to endangerment in our native species. What do you think we can do to stop this? We can eat more chicken nuggets. Amaya? Amaya, snap out of it! Oh, yeah, right, sorry. We can call the Missouri Department of Conservation, or the MDC, to help us set up traps to trap the hogs in. And the MDC can do something with them afterwards. That sounds like a better plan. But how do we build the traps? Well, you want to build your traps out of livestock pinning, or material, material similar to that, and make sure to make the traps at least four feet wide, eight feet long, and five feet high. Also, there is no need to build a roof because the hogs won't jump out. Plus, we can add corn in the traps. That is a great idea. We can also fill the traps with mud because the hogs like to wallow in mud so it might lure them into the traps. Also, a way to know that feral hogs have been there is that they rub their bodies on the bases of trees when they are covered with mud. That's a smart proposal. Where'd you get that from? I got it from my brain. At least a small piece that's left. Well then, let's get back on the topic. Okay, well, we'll just go to another problem that they cause. No, that's a good idea. So back on topic. Another problem with feral hogs is that they produce six piglets per birth and give birth about twice a year. <laughs> now that's a real problem because that means we will have more and more feral hogs by every year. The best I can say is to leave it to the professionals to fix the hog problem. But you can still put in your work by setting up traps and calling the MDC for extra help. Most people say just to shoot them, but that is not the right thing to do. Try to stay away from killing these animals, although they are major pests. That's right, stay away from killing them. Also, the damage from feral hogs has been estimated to be $1.5 billion a year in the United States. That's a lot of money. Yeah, well, we can put in money and have a fundraiser to fix the damage they've caused and to help build traps. Yeah, and all you guys can pitch in too and help stop this problem from going to something even worse. If you spot a feral hog, contact the MDC immediately because they can help us do something with them and keep your land protected. Well, if you agree, that should be a wrap. We'll see you guys later. Meet us back on Science Mania! Science Mania!